imagine yourself on a boat in the middle of a calm and placid ocean. One moment, everything is serene and quiet, but the next, the sky darkens and the sea churns. The gentle waves turn into gargantuan mountains of water, threatening to swallow your small boat. Now imagine that storm has a name, La Nina. But who is this enigmatic lady, and how can she transform a peaceful day of sailing into a turbulent nightmare? How do we prepare for her arrival? And what is her impact on our climate and our lives? Stay with us and discover. In the cosmic dance of Earth's climate, La Nina is El Nino's dance partner, but with her own personality, her own influences, and her own story. While El Nino heats the stage with his energy and fury, La Nina cools things down with her cold, serene presence. But don't be fooled by her cold exterior. Did you know that La Nina can have just as dramatic an impact on global climate as her hot brother, El Nino? But how and why? Submerged in the depths of the equatorial Pacific, she dances, and her dance cools the warm waters, leading to lower than normal sea surface temperatures. But don't think her effect is limited to the ocean. No, her dance reverberates through the air, altering winds and climate patterns in her wake. This intensification, although it may seem insignificant, has the potential to trigger a chain of climatic events on a global scale. And, like her brother, La Nina is capricious, appearing in our oceans every few years, with a frequency that oscillates between two to seven years. Each dance can last from several months to a couple of years, leaving a trail of climatic changes in its wake. And don't think these changes are necessarily smooth. On the contrary, La Nina conditions can lead to extreme weather patterns. While some regions may suffer severe droughts, others may experience catastrophic flooding. This climatic phenomenon, characterized by colder than average temperatures in the equatorial Pacific Ocean, is not simply the cold opposite of El Nino. Like an intriguing and mysterious sister, La Nina plays her own game. While El Nino can bring droughts to Australia and heavy rains to Peru, what can the world expect from La Nina? La Nina may seem cold and inhospitable, but her impact is as intense as her warm brother. She can cool summers, but she can cause brutal winters, floods, and even hurricanes. But what does this mean for us, for farmers, for city dwellers, for national and global economies? As we adapt to La Nina, Farmers have proven to be true pioneers of adaptability. Recent advances in biotechnology have allowed the development of cold-resistant crop varieties. So in places like India, where La Nina can weaken the monsoons and lead to colder winters, farmers are switching to these more resistant varieties. Can you imagine the astonishing sight of wheat fields blooming in the middle of a particularly cold winter? And it's not just in the field where we are adapting. Meteorologists and climate scientists are working tirelessly to improve our ability to predict La Nina events. Advanced computer models can now predict a La Nina event up to six months in advance, allowing us to prepare for its effects. Can you imagine a future where we can see the arrival of La Nina as we see the arrival of winter? But it's not just in preparation where we are innovating. Infrastructures are also changing to better resist the effects of La Nina. In countries like Bangladesh, where floods can be more common during a La Nina event, elevated houses and roads are being built to withstand the rise of water. In addition, drainage systems are being improved to prevent water accumulation. Could you conceive a world where our cities flow with water instead of fighting against it? In forest areas that are at risk of fires during La Nina events, Controlled burns are being carried out to remove excess vegetation. This way, the amount of fuel available for fires is reduced, decreasing the risk of uncontrolled fires when La Nina arrives. Can you imagine a forest that is managed not only by humans, but also by fire? The story of our adaptation to La Nina is one of resilience and of an incredible capacity to adapt to the most extreme conditions. 
But our relationship with climatic phenomena goes beyond La Nina and El Nino. If our struggles with Earth's changing climate continue to escalate, could we be on the brink of seeking new homes beyond our own planet? Stay tuned for our next video, where we delve into humanity's ongoing quest for habitable planets elsewhere in the cosmos. The universe is vast and we are but a speck in it. Could we thrive in another corner of this immense cosmic expanse? Be sure to join us as we continue to explore these pressing questions about our future.